welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. My name is Melinda. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing my gift guide. So I have 50 different gift ideas that I'm going to be sharing with you guys. So if you're interested in seeing what those are, then just keep watching. So first of all, I'm trying to sit like off center so I can put pictures in here of everything I'm going to be talking about. But um, I just want to say a few things really quickly. One, a few of these items are going to be repeats from my Amazon favorites video, but um, I do have a lot of other products that I think would make really good gifts. So I will link that video down below because I don't just want to like recap every single thing that I mentioned in that video, but it is my favorite. So I do love all those products. So yeah, if you want even more ideas, definitely go check out that video. And then I did want to say one other thing. If you're not following me on my Instagram and you want to have a little bit more of a say or input into the videos that I'm making, I do polls on my Instagram very frequently asking what videos you guys want to see. So I actually did one where it was my Amazon favorites or gift ideas and more of you voted for Amazon favorites. So I went ahead and made that video, but a lot of y'all still voted for the gift guide. So I wanted to go ahead and make that too. Let me go ahead and get started with my gift ideas. So gift number one is scrunchies. Everyone loves scrunchies. I'm obsessed with them. I think they're so fun. They're cute. They're a really cute way to like just add to your outfit. And I found these like multi-packs on Amazon that I think are so cute and they have a bunch of different colors in them. So you just get a lot of variety. And one thing I did want to mention is my brother's girlfriend actually makes scrunchy Apple Watch bands. So she makes, she has like a few different color options. I'll put the pictures up here so you can see what I'm talking about. And then I'll also link her Instagram down below. So if you guys want to buy any of those from her, definitely do that. They're super cute. And I always love supporting small businesses around Christmas time. So the second thing is barrettes. So like this one that I have in my hair right here, I will try and link this one down below. I'm pretty sure I got it off Amazon, but it's like a little leopard print. It's so freaking cute. I love it. <laughs> I'm out of breath already. The third thing is head scarves or headbands. I love these too, especially if you have like curly or wavy hair. Your hair kind of looks different every single day. So I love just being able to like toss my hair up, but then wrap like a little head scarf around my hair to just add like a little bit to it. So it's not just like a boring bun. You have like a little bit more of a style going on, even though it was like super simple. I love wearing head scarves. Number four is a self tanner. So I really love Bondi Sands and I like Loving Tan also. So in the Bondi Sands tanner, I love the six hour, the six hour tan, the ultra dark one. And then in Loving Tan, I like the two hour express, just the dark one. So you could get someone like a whole kit with like the tanner and then the mitt to apply it, the exfoliating mitt to remove it. And then you can get them like a little oil. I know Bondi Sands has a lot of different accessories you can add to the tanner. So like an oil that is like a gradual tanner to kind of prolong their tan throughout the week. So I think that would make a really great gift. So that was four and five. Number six is a burner and oils. So I'm going to put on the screen and link down below the ones that I actually bought for one of my friends for her birthday. And she said she loves it. The scents are like very fall and like Christmas time. So it's perfect as a Christmas gift. This is a great alternative to candles. And I think it's like such a good gift idea. I love it. I actually want to buy one for myself too. Cause she like really said it was amazing and she loved it and so now I need one. Okay, number seven, if you have any makeup lovers in your family or your friends, mascara and lip gloss. So my current favorite mascara is the Maybelline the Colossal Big Shot and my current favorite lip gloss is the e.l.f. Lip Plumping Gloss and I'm completely obsessed with both of these. They're amazing. I think it's a really awesome gift to get someone that loves makeup, but you don't have to know their makeup preferences. So you're not buying them like a bold, like fiery red lipstick and they may not be into that. So if you get like everyone wears mascara. So if you get them a good mascara, I highly recommend that one. And then a lip gloss, like pretty much everyone loves lip gloss and you don't have to know like their skin tone or their skin type or anything. So I think it's like a really good gift that's very safe. Next is a sheet mask. I'm gonna put, uh, sorry, I'm putting everything on the screen. I need to stop saying that, but this is my absolute favorite sheet mask. I love it so much. First of all, I'm just really into sheet masks in general because they're so easy. You literally just put them on and then when you take them off, you don't have to rinse anything off your face. You typically just like massage the product into your skin. And I love that. This one is extremely hydrating and plumping also. Like my smile line, I use this mask one time and my smile line like completely went away for that day. Now it's not 
not like long lasting results. You have to keep using it obviously, but it's really good. Like if you're about to go somewhere really special and you want to put that mask on before your makeup, it'll really help your makeup look a lot more um, smooth because it just really improves the texture of your skin. It's really awesome. I love it so much. So the next thing is a dry brush. I love dry brushing. It helps with circulation, with exfoliation, and you brush your body towards your heart. It's really awesome. And it, like I said, it's good for circulation and just overall like skin health. The next thing, number 10, is a deep conditioning hair mask everyone loves those girls especially love like very like spa things and like relaxing and just anything that has to do with pampering we love it's amazing so in the same category a jade roller these are awesome everyone needs one of them they're amazing so the next thing number 12 is a microwavable mask for like sinus pressure it is like Cold weather, people are getting sick and stuffy and sniffly. I absolutely love having something like this because when you get really bad sinus pressure, it hurts so bad and it feels nice to just have something like warm on there to just relax you. It's amazing. Number 13, a makeup brush holder and a travel case in one. I actually have been meaning to buy this for myself because I think it's so cute and will be really useful. Number 14, one of those little cotton head wraps to wash your face. So you put your hair up and then you wrap it around like the border of your head. So when you're splashing your face with water, you're not getting all of your hair wet. Number 15, you can get someone that loves nail polish, a really good base coat and a top coat. Again, similar to the mascara and the lip gloss, it's kind of a safe option if you don't know someone's preferences with their polish. Everyone can always use a good base coat and a top coat and you can also get them some other nail accessories like um, a nail file or a cuticle trimmer or like the cuticle removing cream. All those would make a really cute little basket if you do like a little themed box or a themed basket to give to someone. I think that would be a really cute idea. But super basic but just a TJ Maxx, Target or Amazon gift card. Those are always great ideas and then they can just get whatever they want. Number 16, peel and stick tiles for a DIY backsplash. I think this is such a good, that was a mixture of cute and good. I think this is such a cute idea. I'm actually gonna be buying these for our kitchen and maybe for a bathroom, I'm not 100% sure, but these are awesome, especially if you're not super handy and you can't do tile work yourself, or if you're renting or you like still live at home and you're not allowed to actually do like major renovations to things. So these are amazing and they're the cute little subway tiles that are super in right now. Number 18 is something handcrafted. So I love these little nude drawings and paintings where um, it's all the same color story. I think they're so cute, like this little rainbow picture, for example, or um the little line art drawings i think these are so cute i've made so many of these for our house and i intend to make a lot more i love them and they're really popular right now too number 19 is felt hangers these are awesome so your clothes don't like slide off and fall in your closet that drives me insane number 20 is a clothing rack this one is bamboo i am obsessed with this i talk about this in my aunt am I can't need to calm down. I talked about this in my Amazon favorites video and I love it. It's um, like I said, it's bamboo and I think it fits in perfectly with that mid-century modern style. Number 21 is The Office or Friends, the two TV shows, any merch from them. I know everyone's like obsessed with those two shows. So you could get them um, a shirt or like a sweatshirt that is something in reference to the show. I think they would really like that if they like the show. Number 22, so I have a few items for guys. If you have a guy in your life that loves golfing, I have two items. So, so the first item is a ball marker. I actually got this for my husband for his birthday and it says, that's what she said on it. And it's from the office. He loves the office. He thought it was so funny. He loves it. And he said it was actually really functional. And he said that um, it was better than his other ball marker that he had. So he actually like, really liked it not just because it was the office but because it worked really well and then also this little booklet it's another golf accessory but they can like keep track of their score in this and he also took that with him he said it was really nice like the sides of it it just fits right in your back pocket so it's really handy and he actually shot his best round is that how you say that i don't know he played the best he'd ever played it was totally because of my gifts. Here's another idea. I actually just made this up in my head, so I hope this is a real thing. If there's pictures on the screen, then it's a real thing. But my husband plays guitar, and I always see him like cleaning his guitar strings after he plays. So I thought a really cute gift idea would be like a personalized cloth to do that if you have someone in your life that plays guitar. That was number 24. Number 25 is a cool patterned guitar strap. He actually sent me a bunch that he wanted, and here's a few pictures of some that I just like think are really cute. There were some that he sent 
sent me that was like orange velvet and oh my gosh, it was so beautiful. So on the same kind of vibe would be a camera strap. So if you have anyone in your family or friends that is really into photography, you could get them a cool camera strap. I got that for my sister-in-law last year and she really loved it. Um, number 27, for anyone that's really into art, we also got my sister-in-law a little leather pen and pencil pouch. It literally rolls up into like a little ball and then you unroll it and you like tuck all your little art supplies inside of it. It's super nice, she really liked it. Number 28 is a wood burning kit with some wood. I had never heard of wood burning before and my mom actually introduced me to it. Let me actually get the thing that I, or one of the things I made. So it's basically this little tool that gets extremely hot and you literally can like burn little designs into wood. So I made this. I think it's such a cool gift. A lot of friends and family have asked me to make little personalized ones for them. And I think it's such a good handmade gift to give to somebody. Another thing that I have here, so I'm just gonna show it to you, is this little thing to like hold your phone. My mom actually got this for me and I seriously use it every single day. So it just will like sit on your desk and hold your phone up like this. And I absolutely love it. My pop socket actually broke so I can't use that to hold my phone up anymore and so I use this and it's a cute little giraffe which is my favorite animal so anything like this is such a handy thing to have number 30 is a pothos plant if you have someone that wants to get into house plants and having plants I think a pothos is the perfect one to start with it's pretty low maintenance requires little light and they're so so beautiful I love them number 38 is a little pinky promise necklace I think so cute it's this little necklace that has like two hands like pinky promising on it and it's really cute. It was like two bucks and I'm obsessed with it. I love it. But number 32 is this little ring holder. I bought this at TJ Maxx and I actually don't know if it was intended to be a ring holder, but that's what I use it as. I think it's so cute. This is actually my personal one. Number 33, I bought this piece of driftwood from TJ Maxx and I use this to store my necklaces. So I think that is like such a cute idea. I thought like I was really proud of that to be honest. Number 34 is these little wire boards are really popular right now. I actually use mine to store my sunglasses and then I want to get um, a came with like little clips and I want to like clip little pictures to it. I think that would be really cute. And that's a fairly cheap gift to get somebody. Number 35, if they do YouTube or Instagram, I could get them some equipment for that. So I have a few different ideas for um, gifts in like that category. So the first thing would be a mic. I'm actually asking for that for Christmas for myself. And then number 36 would be box lights. You can get them like fairly cheap on Amazon. It's a little bit more expensive, but maybe like 50 bucks or 60 or something for like a cheap set on Amazon. Number 37 is a ring light. So I did mention this in my Amazon favorites. This is my favorite. I am like obsessed with this ring light and it was like $25. So very affordable for a ring light. Number 38 is this little SD card reader. Um, again, I mentioned this in my Amazon video, but basically it has an import for an SD card and then it go the other end attaches to your phone. So when you're out taking pictures of yourself or whatever it is, you don't have to wait until you get back home to get the pictures off of your SD card onto your phone. You can get them off immediately and then post them immediately if you want to. And then you have the high quality pictures from your camera straight to your phone. It's such a great thing to have. I love this. Number 39 is this remote control shutter release. I'm not sure if that's exactly what it's called, but basically you can take pictures with Bluetooth. So again, if anyone does like Instagram, it's really nice to have that if you don't have someone to take your pictures for you. Number 40 is string lights for their bedroom. Everyone loves string lights. They're so cute, especially for Christmas time. Number 41 is the little um, cheapo like film cameras that everyone's really into. You could get that and then like some film. I don't even know how those work anymore, to be honest. I used them when I was little, but anyways, like everyone loves Loves those. So you can get them that. A little bit more expensive, number 42 is an actual Polaroid camera. That would be such a cute gift. Um, number 43 is some throw pillows. These are the ones that we actually have on our couch right now. I'm obsessed with them. Just so you know though, it is only the cases. You do have to stuff them yourselves, but we literally just stuffed our old throw pillows inside of the cases. So we just did it that way. Um, number 44 is a throw blanket. Everyone loves throw blankets. Hello. It's amazing. For decoration and they are they actually like are useful, so it's great. Number 45, you can also get them a little basket to put their blankets in. This is actually ours and I'm obsessed with it. Number 46 is a little plug-in blanket for the car. This is such a good idea. If you have anyone in your family or friends, it gets really cold. I am very hot natured. I would hate this gift, but I know some people that would love to have something like this. I think it literally plugs into like your cigarette lighter or something like that. And then it like heats up and you have a heated blanket in your car, very handy. 
Number 47 is you could pay for a few months subscription to an Ipsy glam bag or a BoxyCharm if you have anyone that is interested in getting started with makeup but they like struggle to know what products to buy. I actually got a BoxyCharm and an Ipsy when I first started with makeup because I just felt very overwhelmed with shopping for products and it was nice to just have like ones that were already picked out sent to me and I actually found a lot of products that I really really love that way so that's a really cool gift. Number 48 is a wallet phone case. That's what this one is. I love it. Um, the little like pool thing did break off of it, but the zipper has lasted so well. Like I love this. I just need to make a new little thing for this and I'm going to use it until it dies. Number 49, buy this at your own risk. I don't know how safe these are, but little disposable ear piercing kits I think is such a cool gift. I'm going to buy this for myself and try it. So yeah, like I said, do it at your own risk. Um, at number 50, these little lightning bolt earrings. Oh my gosh, I literally think these are so cute. I'm gonna give you a bonus one because if you watched my Amazon favorites video, then you know that Brian told me that these made bad gifts, but I'm gonna recommend them anyways because I would be excited to get this. If you know anybody that just moved into a new house or a new apartment or they're like moving out for the first time or just bought their first house, this little um these little rubber scraper tools i'm obsessed with them they're so amazing you can use them to clean your pants off scrape food off your countertop scrape things off the floor i've used it to remove like little labels from glass bottles they are so multi purpose and multi-functional i can never think of those words and then included in the set you could get them this little scrubby brush instead of sponges since dish sponges are really gross this is a great alternative and then lastly these little oven liners you literally put them in the bottom of your oven so it catches all the like food drips and everything so the bottom of your oven stays cleaner and doesn't get like caked with a bunch of gross stuff and then it like smokes up your house so yeah i think those would be really cute but i mean buy them if you want to i don't know brian told me that those are lame christmas gifts but i would like them so yeah guys that completes this video i really hope you guys enjoyed it i hope i wasn't talking too fast i can never tell if i am or not but i just want to get through all of it really quickly but yeah i hope this video helped you and at least like sparked some ideas of things that you could potentially get some people in your life. If you like this video or if it was helpful to you, definitely give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you want to and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. So, no, um, well, um, 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 is the, um, um, is, um, 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 so, um, um,